Hi SI, it's Miss Winger, and today I want to talk to you about a resource called Lynda, L-Y-N-D-A. Um, what's really fascinating about Lynda is that it is a collection of courses designed for people to pursue their passions. Um, there are courses in technology and web development, courses in business skills. They're all free. Um, they're all available through SFPL. You may be wondering, how could this help you? Well, let me show you a little bit. First, let me show you how to get there. If we're on SFPL, choose Research and Learn. Choose e-learning. Scroll down to Linda. Here, enter your library card and PIN and log in. You'll get to Linda and it will ask you to create an account. I've logged in with my account on Linda and you get to a page that looks like this. Now, it's a lot to digest at first and I, and I think you may be wondering, why would I even want to know about this? But imagine, imagine something small, that you want to become a better photo, uh, photographer. So let's see what's available in photography. Well, you can uh, improve your Photoshop skills. You can master Instagram to make all those filters work for you. Let's click on Photoshop. When you're in an area, you can decide whether your skill level is beginner or if you're really advanced and you really want to master InDesign and Photoshop and related Illustrator um, software, this could be really powerful for you. So that's just if you want to do one small thing. But imagine this, you're really into online gaming. And in fact, you can imagine yourself becoming a professional animator. And so to, to examine or pursue that career, you might choose 3D animation, okay? And you might choose be, the learning path, become a 3D character animator. What this does is it guides you through a series of classes, free courses, and teaches you a variety of tools to use to do 3D animation. Notice the classes are taught by experts. They get into details, helps you think about how you would use this information, tells you the experts that you'd be working with. And then if you got really, really, really into this, okay, you could get even deeper into 3D uh, animation. You could look at um, animation, you could master Maya, the program Maya. Say you're advanced, advanced mechanics and CG animation. So a lot of resources for you here to develop the schools, the skills that you are interested in exploring. The summer could be a really good time to explore a passion of yours. Let's think about a different one. Say you're a really good knitter or you have a craft that you're very good at and you think, I've got time this summer. What about learning how to make money off of that hobby of mine? How could I do that? Well, let's look at library. Let's look at business. And you've got a craft or a, a baking skill. What about becoming a craft business owner? Here, once again, it'll walk you through specific classes to help you develop a business plan, set up your small business, learn how to photograph the crafts with the baking that you make, how to uh, better serve your customers, hear the experts you'll learn from. By the end of the summer, you might have turned your hobby, your interest, into a money-making business. Once again, to explore Linda is very easy. You use the e-learning path from SFPL, log in with your library card and PIN, and then set up an account on Linda. Choose a course or the learning path 
that most interests you. I hope you enjoy exploring Linda and seeing what it can offer you. If you have any questions about accessing Linda or using it to, to build your own skills, please reach out to me or Ms. Brancoli. You can email us at si underscore librarians at siprep.org. We look forward to hearing from you. Love, the library.